Imagine a time long ago, far beyond human memory, when the Earth was a vastly different place. The air was thick with mystery and the land was teeming with life forms that seem almost mythical to us now. This was the Mesozoic era, often referred to as the Age of Reptiles, a time when dinosaurs ruled the Earth. It began about 252 million years ago and lasted for a staggering 186 million years, a period marked by incredible transformations. The Mesozoic era was a time of dramatic change, witnessing the rise and fall of some of the most magnificent creatures ever to walk the Earth, the dinosaurs. The Mesozoic era is divided into three periods, the Triassic, Jurassic and Cretaceous each with its own unique characteristics and evolutionary milestones. The Jurassic period, sandwiched between the Triassic and Cretaceous, spanned from 201 to 145 million years ago, a time of flourishing life and dynamic changes. It is in the Jurassic that our story unfolds, a time when dinosaurs truly came into their own, dominating the land, sea and air. The Jurassic was a period of significant geological and biological activity, with volcanic eruptions and shifting continents shaping the world. The supercontinent Pangaea, which had dominated the Triassic, began to break apart, leading to the formation of new land masses and oceans. This event had profound implications for life on Earth, leading to the evolution of new and diverse species, each adapting to their changing environments. The Jurassic was a remarkable chapter in Earth's history, filled with lush landscapes and a myriad of life forms. It was a time of giants, both on land and in the sea, with enormous dinosaurs and marine reptiles dominating their respective realms. It was a time of dramatic change, as the world we know today began to take shape, setting the stage for future eras. Join us now as we journey back to the Jurassic, a time of wonder and adventure, where the past comes alive in vivid detail. At the dawn of the Jurassic, all the Earth's landmasses were clumped together into one gigantic supercontinent. We call this supercontinent Pangaea. Pangaea was surrounded by a vast singular ocean called Panthalassa. However, deep beneath the Earth's surface, powerful forces were at work. Throughout the Triassic and into the Jurassic, these forces slowly pulled Pangaea apart. This process is called continental drift. Giant cracks called rifts appeared in the Earth's crust, splitting Pangaea into separate land masses. As these land masses drifted apart, new seas and oceans were formed in the gaps. The breakup of Pangaea was a slow and gradual process, unfolding over millions of years, but its impact on life on Earth was profound. The separation of continents led to the isolation of plant and animal populations, setting the stage for the evolution of new and unique species. As Pangaea fractured and drifted, the Earth's geography underwent a dramatic transformation. The ancient supercontinent gave way to new continents, islands and archipelagos. These land masses, no longer connected, embarked on their own separate journeys across the globe. The Tethys Sea, a massive body of water, expanded between the northern and southern land masses. This warm, shallow sea teemed with life and played a crucial role in the evolution of marine reptiles. The newly formed continents experienced a wider range of climates compared to Pangaea. Inland seas and lakes dotted the landscapes, creating diverse freshwater habitats. Vast river systems carved their way across the continents, shaping the land and providing vital lifelines for plants and animals. The breakup of Pangaea led to a greater diversity of habitats, paving the way for an explosion of life in the Jurassic. The Jurassic period was a time of incredible biodiversity, with life flourishing in a variety of ecosystems. Lush forests carpeted vast swaths of land, their canopies dominated by towering conifer trees. Ferns, cycads and ginkgos thrived in the undergrowth, creating a vibrant and verdant tapestry. In drier regions, deserts spread across the landscape, their sand dunes sculpted by the wind. Despite the harsh conditions, life found a way to thrive in these arid environments. Specialized plants and animals evolved to survive the scorching heat and scarce water sources. The Jurassic saw the emergence of flowering plants, or angiosperms. These plants, with their enclosed seeds and vibrant flowers, would eventually revolutionize life on land. They provided a new source of food for animals and played a crucial role in the evolution of insects. 
Section 5, Giants Among Giants, the Reign of the Sauropods. The Jurassic period marked the reign of the dinosaurs and among these magnificent creatures, the sauropods stood out as true giants. These long-necked herbivores were the largest animals to ever walk the earth, dwarfing even the largest land mammals of today. Sauropods such as Brachiosaurus and Apatosaurus possessed massive bodies, long necks, small heads and long tails. They were gentle giants grazing on the abundant vegetation of the Jurassic. Their long necks allowed them to reach high into the trees, while their long tails provided balance and defense against predators. These colossal creatures roamed the earth for over 100 million years, leaving an indelible mark on the fossil record. Their immense size and gentle nature continue to fascinate and inspire awe in those who study them. The Jurassic landscape was not without its share of drama and danger. It was a world teeming with life, where every day was a battle for survival. Alongside the gentle giants roamed fearsome predators, the theropod dinosaurs. These creatures were always on the lookout for their next meal, stalking the vast plains and dense forests. These bipedal carnivores were the apex predators of their time. Their sharp teeth and claws a constant threat to herbivores. Their hunting strategies were both cunning and brutal. Allosaurus, with its powerful legs, short arms and massive head, was one of the most formidable theropods of the Jurassic. Its sheer size and strength made it a dominant force. It likely preyed upon a variety of dinosaurs, including the armored stegosaurs. The interactions between these giants were nothing short of epic. Stegosaurs, with their distinctive plates and spikes, were well equipped to defend themselves against predators. These features were not just for show, but were vital for their survival. Stegosaurus, with its small head, short neck and massive body, was a herbivore. It spent its days grazing on low-lying plants, always wary of lurking predators. Its most striking feature was the double row of plates running down its back, which may have served for thermoregulation or display. These plates were a marvel of natural engineering. The Jurassic was a time of constant struggle for survival, as predators and prey evolved alongside each other in an ever-changing dance of life and death. This dynamic interplay shaped the very landscape they inhabited. While dinosaurs ruled the land, the Jurassic seas and skies were teeming with their own cast of fascinating creatures. Marine reptiles such as ichthyosaurs and plesiosaurs patrolled the oceans, their streamlined bodies perfectly adapted for life in the water. Ichthyosaurs with their dolphin-like bodies and large eyes were swift and agile predators, feeding on fish and squid. Plesiosaurs with their long necks, small heads and four flippers were more specialized feeders, using their necks to snatch prey from the seabed. Pterosaurs, the first vertebrates to evolve powered flight, soared through the skies. These flying reptiles, with their membranous wings and hollow bones, ranged in size from small bird-like creatures to giants with wingspans exceeding 30 feet. Pterosaurs played an important role in the Jurassic ecosystem, filling a variety of ecological niches. While dinosaurs dominated the Jurassic, a new group of animals was quietly emerging, the mammals. These small furry creatures were mostly nocturnal, living in the shadows of the giant reptiles. Early mammals were generally small mouse to opossum-sized animals. They possessed several key mammalian features, such as fur or hair, mammary glands, and a more efficient metabolism. These adaptations helped them to survive in a world dominated by reptiles. While they may have been small and inconspicuous, these early mammals possessed the potential for greatness. They were the ancestors of all mammals alive today, including ourselves. As the Jurassic period drew to a close, the Earth continued to change, undergoing significant geological and climatic transformations. The continents drifted further apart, creating vast oceans and new coastlines, and new mountain ranges were formed, reshaping the landscape. The climate became warmer and more humid, leading to the expansion of lush rainforests and the rise of sea levels, which flooded coastal areas. These environmental changes had a profound impact on life on Earth, driving evolution and adaptation among various species. 
The Jurassic Cretaceous extinction event, while not as severe as the Permian Triassic extinction, led to the extinction of many plant and animal species, altering the course of evolution. However, it also paved the way for the evolution of new and even more spectacular creatures, setting the stage for the next era. The Cretaceous period, which followed the Jurassic, would witness the rise of iconic dinosaurs like the Tyrannosaurus rex and the Triceratops dominating the prehistoric world. The Jurassic period left behind a rich legacy, a testament to the incredible diversity and adaptability of life on Earth, showcasing a wide array of fascinating creatures. Its fossils continue to inspire awe and wonder, providing a glimpse into a lost world of giants and wonder, and helping scientists understand the history of our planet.